So this example is available upon request. Uh, this example implements Verizon's uh, 5G technical forum based uh, uh, downlink transmission, uh, which includes the XPBCH, which is the broadcast channel, XPDCCH, the control channel, and XPDSCH, the data channel. And we have the corresponding transmitter and the receiver uh, already set up in here with a, a behavioral amplifier dot in between. And this project is set up so that you can do uh, various measurements that, that I will walk, uh, will walk you through uh, right now. So as you can see here, uh, this is 100 megahertz wide uh, signal uh, before the PA, uh, before the dot and after the dot, we see some spectral regrowth at the output of the spectrum. And we have set up some uh, CD, CCDF measurement where we see the uh, input to the dot and the output of the dot, uh, CCDF. Uh, there's also a parallel uh, power sweep uh, measurement going on, uh, looking at the um, signal operating on the AM, AM, AM to AM curve. The IQ constellation plot shows you the received uh, demodulated uh, IQ constellation for both the uh, XPDCCH and the XPDSCH. Uh, there are some um, ACPR measurements at 100 megahertz and 200 megahertz offset that represents these uh, uh, channels for the Verizon 5G specification. And the uh, EVM uh, versus the input power, output power sweep. Uh, that shows you the EVM characteristics as a function of output power. So <coughs> by replacing this dot element with the dot uh, of your uh, interest, uh, you can quickly uh, turn this into a, a Verizon 5G based uh, test bench to evaluate the performance of your system uh, according to the 5G specification. But because the 5G, uh, Verizon 5G specification is a running uh, specification at this point, uh, we have this only available uh, upon request. Uh, 